In the SRE world, we hear terms like reliability, resilience, disaster recovery, backups that are all used interchangeably all the time. Are they the same thing? No, they are not. Let's start with reliability and resilience. What is reliability? Reliability is simple. If a system is asked over and over again to accomplish a task, how often will it succeed? For example, a reliable car drives smoothly and gets you to your destination without issues 99% of the time. And reliability is usually measured by a metric like SLA, which is an agreement with your end user. For example, a reliable application will play videos without buffering and it works 99.9% of the time. Resiliency, on the other hand, is how well a system recovers from a failure and keeps going. For example, if your car gets a flat tire, resiliency is having a spare and replacing it quickly so you can keep driving and get to your destination. Resilience is measured using metrics like RTO, which is recovery time objective, which is how fast the system recovers, or RPO, our recovery point objective, how much data is lost during the failure. For example, if one server crashes, a resilient application will instantly switch to your HA server so your app keeps running without interruption. Now, how does reliability and resilience work together? You almost always need resiliency to achieve reliability. Why? If your car doesn't have a spare tire, your car will not get you to your destination 99% of the time, thus making your car unreliable. If you only have a single server and it crashes and it stops streaming, it makes your app unreliable. But if it detects and recovers from the error, it remains reliable because it is resilient.